Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Deponia on Christmas. Yay! When we last left off, we, um, the Holy Spirit compelled us to give Wenzel a water well and make him incredibly rich. I'm going to leave now. It's depressing. Um, well, actually, we're going to the alley first, because this guy said he can get keys, so let's talk to Hanek. Hello again. Hey, uh, um, uh, 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 Rufus. Exactly. About my key. About my key again? Again? Well, if you insist. What was your name again? I'll try these three. Sugar Puff. Sugar Puff? Hmm. Maybe I found your key, Sugar Puff, but I need to be sure it really belongs to you. What's your favorite color? Pink. Pink. Pink, you say? That sounds about right. And, uh, do you have a special hobby? Uh, no. I, uh, love the ballet. <laughs> Bullseye! Then this must be your key. This must be your lucky day, Sugar Puff. Yeah? I'm so happy I could just explode. Really? I might have a one-time job for you down in the mine. Expression. Seriously. Expression. But still, we have Sugar Puff, the key for Sugar Puff's car. Uh, I wonder if we can use the magnetic field thingy on the... Bull. <laughs> the bull is a time for a. No, I don't work. Oh well, key to truck. I open the door. Pull the lever. And we always pull the lever for these things. And then you flip the hood. And give me a battery. <laughs> oh. I can't remove it, but how do I get access to the power that's harbored within them? Okay. Syringe? I can't crack open the hull with this, but how do I get access to the power that's harbored within them? Okay, so it's not that. <laughs> I want the battery acid, and I have a dentist drill. <laughs> that's almost too convenient. Uh, ah! Ow! <laughs> yeah! Ow! I'll take the acid now. Ha <laughs> ha! I've siphoned the acid without injuring myself. I'll drink to that. <laughs> Moron. How do I get... Now let's see I need to figure out is... Uh, I want to get the... Oh. You have to be age 18. Ah, the blood mode. Well, it's still below my class, but at least the taurine tanks are open now. Uh, yeah, but we can't ride it. Ha <laughs> ha! Time! Range enough, yeah, time for rodeo. Uh, every time we ride it, we get knocked off. Ha <laughs> The bull time for a... No, no, that's still the wrong thing. Okay, I'm not sure. One of these things, we got lots of devices here, but we... What do we... Hmm, maybe we're still missing something to get the bit right? I mean, if we have got a load of things, but I'm not seeing how to, uh, oh, excuse me, sorry about that, to get past the, um, uh, bull. I'm gonna, be something, I'm gonna be doing something here wrong to get this bull's blood. Something is, we're missing a device. I mean, we got the thing enraged. So... So we need to now get the thing... ...sorted out, so now it's got, we got it enraged. Now we just need to get the damn thing.
Uh, Coming to the chance of jabbing him now with the syringe. Yeah, that usually works. Damn it. Draw blood from an enraged bull? <laughs> Child's play. Hey, it works. <laughs> I must admit, I've tried the syringe with him like five or six oh, times before now. Oh. Got it. Bull's blood. Check. That just leaves the clear water. How do I get it? Tony's tranquilizer. Dr. Gizmo says it deals with the symptoms only, not with the cause. I wonder what he meant by that. They meant you. All that's missing is a blowpipe. Hmm. The funnel would make an excellent blowpipe. Ah. <laughs> Indeed. I now have a blowpipe. What am I supposed to use that on? Extra rich water and reviving bull's blood. Exactly what good coffee water needs. I'm still missing the final ingredient. Clear water. I got most of it. Probably I should have something there. Work. Yeah, right. She's just sitting there twiddling her thumbs. I can do that too. Yeah, you know I'm gonna try the blow pipe on that. This being so funny. I am going to shoot you with that now. <laughs> So, let's fire! Well, are you gonna fire that or not? Let's go there twice. What the? A dart? A little longer. And... Ah. Oh, what am I getting mad at anyway? Strike! Hey, Tony, I'll just grab a couple of these vouchers, okay? Thank you. And while we're at it, can you do the dishes this week? <laughs> <laughs> I like Tony much better this way. <laughs> I was beginning to fear that her body had adapted to tranquilizers. <laughs> oh, uh, by the way, I used your family pictures to insulate a weather balloon. Mm, just, um, just, just a moment. What? Uh, Did you mention weather balloons? No, no, no. I said uh, vouchers. Will, will you look at those, those nifty vouchers? <laughs> Keep your hands off. I've counted them. Too late. <laughs> I think the weather balloon wouldn't be in touch too much. Right. Uh, it won't touch the well. A legend said, wait, if that was my father's office, and he said he had water. Right. Where's my flying rod? Oh, this thing is beyond repair. Actually, I'll just, like, pick this. Okay, I'm gonna pick the world. <laughs> yeah, that would be fun. I uh, Is that something with a water emblem? Divine it. What's this? A hidden compartment? Well, looks like Dad's wow. secret will see the light of day after all. So, wait, so the divine rod clicks in and... Oh, it's a key. <laughs> a key. My dad knew I'd be clever enough to find it. I wonder what I'd get for it if I melt it down. Uh, don't think. Key to boot or boot cabinet. 
keyhole. This might be unnecessarily complicated, but I'm certain Dad wanted to make sure that I'm the only one who could get this far, get to his big secret, his legacy. His liquor cabinet. Hey. Well, stuff still got cool. Boom. That smell reminds me of something. Dad's aftershave lotion. Okay. Ugh, this tastes like the cough syrup that Dad used to give me when I was too noisy. I want the water though. Oh, that's, I got that done. What do I do with this? Booze? Cool. I already have the special water at least. Anyways, and clear water. Okay. I have ingredients. I have all the ingredients. Time to make the ultimate coffee. Coffee machine. Divine coffee machine. Uh, how many things do I have to push for? Ah, open the straight. Right. I see. Okay, that's gonna be where I put the powder in, because this is how you put do coffee. So, I have the powder already. And now, for the water. The energy rich, power Into water. The tank, you go. Well, that's it. I found all the ingredients. Wonderful! Oh, I can't even tell you power. how excited I am to see what happens next. Me too. But I thought we were making espresso. Yes, you are right. This is an august moment, my <laughs> friend. We shouldn't spoil it by worrying about the pressure within the nuclear core structure. Pressure within the nuclear what? core structure? Hear me, gods of our forefathers. <laughs> um, Using just the most refined ingredients and the highest like possible the room? compression, we beseech thee, open the gates to the espresso verse. Holy smoke. More pressure! More pressure! Okay. Uh, okay. No. What have you done? The espresso verse was never made for this coffee. This is too much. Too much. I destroyed the world! Are we... I don't know. Are we dead? No. Being dead feels completely different. Ugh. As you know, I have gazed deep into death's eyes more than once in my life. Oh, now that you mention it, that reminds me. Is Tony still wearing those contact lenses? Shh! Something's happening. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh. Ouch! That was the most powerful espresso in the world. We have made in. I think this brew is gonna do the job. Oh, killer. <laughs> Even safer. Oh, killer. Lonzo. Ah, oh, Rufus. Did you come to help me clean this place up? Well, yeah. you know, I got this thing going on. I'll come back later, okay? Uh, we, we saw blue. <laughs> the entire machine got blown up. But we made the ultimate espresso. The coffee of all the coffees has been made, and now we'll go and give it to the woman. Hopefully it's not going to kill her. Mr. Mayor, we have espresso. I suggest not to move her in this condition. What kind of condition is she in? Sleeping. I still don't understand. I mean, is she dead? No, no, her body is alive and well. It's her consciousness. It's inactive. So, she's asleep? Well, yes. it's a bit more complicated than that. I think it's related to this implant. It's broken. A consciousness implant? Isn't there a switch or something? A fuse? 
Maybe the contacts are corroded. That's what always happens with my intercom. I already tried everything, but this is Elysian technology. I have no idea how it's being used. Oh, wait, we got I don't coffee. even have the appropriate screwdriver. So, uh, when can I finally take her home? She needs to wake up first. Okay, okay, I see. This situation needs to be resolved through a government decision. Let's do it like this. If you manage to wake her up, you can have her. And what happens if I wake her up? Rufus! You're not even supposed to be here. But I have a plan. Oh, I've heard about yeah, your plans. Coffee. You never think things through. Everything you do ends in chaos, and most likely with an explosion. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we'll see about that. I warn you, stay away from the girl. Hey, goal, goal, wakey, wakey. <laughs> Fast asleep. Very good diagnosis, Doctor. Oh, well, you know, it's just that I'm an expert in uh, <laughs> sleep. I have espresso. What's that stinging smell? That's medicine. Says who? Says I. And who's the doctor here? <laughs> you tell me. Let's say it together. Me. me. It's a draw. Best out of three. <laughs> you. <laughs> me. You. <laughs> ah. I win! Oh, crap. I can't... Uh, thank you, though. The textbook has failed. Now, it's time for me to improvise. What's that supposed to be? That's medicine. And oh, who's well, you? Then. He wouldn't know what to do with it. He doesn't even know what to do with himself. Yeah, and I it. bet he's immune to it. Okay. I want them out of the way. Huh? <gasps> Oh, but Rufus! You're not untouchable, Lotech. Don't you ever forget that. Looky here, Wenzel, too. Did somebody drop food? I mean, what's the deal with the crawling around on the floor? I'm waiting for Gold to wake up so I can take her with me, of course. Ha! Huh, dream on. Although, it is true that ants can carry ten times their own weight. But why would Goal, an Elysian orbit elf, Want to have anything to do with somebody like you? Duh, Rufus! You've always underestimated me. Ugh. Rufus, Rufus! Look at me. I'm a self-made man. Yeah, yeah, whoever made you must have stopped right in the middle. Oh, yeah? I am rich. I've got a water vein running through my basement. You, on the other hand, don't even have a basement. You ain't got nothing, Rufus. Hey. That's how you pay people back when they give their best? And what would I want with a basement in Kuvak? I don't belong here, and neither does Goal. And as soon as I wake her up, I will accompany her to Elysium. You'll see. Right, I need them to get out of the way. Because he won't let me do this. There's something in the background there. Yes. Cardboard box. The balloons seem to have been stored here for quite a while. I wonder what occasion they're meant for, and why my face is on some of them. Uh. There's that. That's cardboard. And the fire sign. I got a fire maker. <laughs> What's that funny smell? Ah! Fire! The town hall's on fire! Fire control mode activated. Firefighter Gizmo at your service. Where is the fire? Over there! The chamber's on fire! Good lord! Don't worry, your fire will be extinguished in no time. Thank you. I'll take this. Finally, I was getting worried I'd have to camp in the cupboard forever. Whoop! Uh, Where was I? Ah, yes. Medical mode activated. Dr. Really? Gizmo just... at your service. How's the patient? I'd say her condition hasn't changed. Leave the diagnosis to the doctor, will you? Now, mm -hmm. just where is my stethoscope? It's gone. Thieves! Crime in progress. Police mode activated. Officer Gizmo at your service. No one leaves the crime scene. I'm gonna put. Huh? 
Uh, but Rufus! You're not untouchable, Lotek. Don't you ever forget that. That's enough. I think you're done. Uh, come on, Gizmo. You have more important things to do. You Don't tell me. me how to do my work. Or are you just trying to divert my attention from your guilt? What? That's simply... Aha! Here is the missing clue. The last piece that completes the puzzle. Civilian, the mystery but... of the thieving mayor has finally been solved. Thieving mayor? How dare you? Put up your hands, Lotek. I have no intention of lifting my hands. You better do what I say. I don't want to. You don't have any choice. I don't? Well, you're fired. You can't fire me. You're arrested. You can't arrest me. You're fired. <laughs> but I arrested you first. So what? <laughs> You're fired anyway. You can't fire me. You're arrested. You can't arrest me. <laughs> You're fired. But Surely. I arrested you first. So what? You're fired. Uh, we'll save. Well, there you are right next to me. Let's be it. You can't fire me. You You're arrested. You can't arrest me. Almost You're there. fired. I but sure I arrested you first. So drop. what? You're fired anyway. You can't fire me. You're arrested. <laughs> you can't like, arrest me. Doing? You're fired. <laughs> but I arrested you first. <laughs> so what? You're fired and... <laughs> I... What... Well... How was that? Me. It was me. <laughs> Ow. Rufus? Are you all right? Ow. Uh, oh, oh. Now we'll have an uppercut. What happened? You woke the stranger, the Elysian girl, and then you got knocked out. Dole? Where is she? How is she? She's still a bit confused. I think her implant was seriously damaged by the fall. She is conscious now, but she's just talking gibberish. Can I... Talk to her? Of course. She's lying over there. I took her into medical custody. Just don't stress her out too much. First and foremost, she needs rest now. No problem. Thanks, Doctor. Hey. Goal? It's me, your savior. Toodle, toodle, toodle. What? No, it's Rufus. Yes. Puts? You can give me any name you like, babe. <laughs> Say, did it hurt a lot when you fell from the sky? <laughs> uh... Oh, come on, that was funny. Nah. Because, I mean, you you really fell from the sky, you know, like an angel. <laughs> Just like in the in the pickup line. <laughs> d d d you get it? Uh, hello? Hello? Anyone home? Home, 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 home. I'll take that as a yes with limitations. Ah, uh, flash dash kazash. <laughs> Savvy, mommy, good. Oh, granny. Grumblump. Puzzle false. Nom 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 nom. nom. <laughs> Munch crunch. Attack a tick tock. Oh! Knock knock. Get a hold of yourself. Soup, soup, soup. Guadeloupe. Yeah, she's attractive and fun to talk to. This is simply useless at the moment. Heck, this is totally useless. That woman is completely nuts. Bonkers, swanker, kazonkers. Oh, what did I expect anyway? That she would take me to Elysium? Elysium. We need to go back to Elysium. What did you just say? Horrible things. The Organon betrayed us. Quick, we need to go back. No to Elysium. Doesn't... Yes, yes. You, you, you remember what happened? Is that you, Cletus? What? No, I'm not. My, my name is Rufus. I saved you. Rufus? I don't understand. Where am I? Um... You, you had a pretty bad fall. The doctor says that you're hallucinating. That's... confusing. But... Oh, 
I need to get to Cletus. Can you take me to him? Who is Cletus? Yeah, who is Cletus? My fiance. Oh. Eek. Oh. Well, I don't know. Maybe you are safer down here. After all, you... He'll reward you generously. Oh, oh. that, uh, uh, generously, you say? Uh, so Try to contact Cletus. He will search for me. Yeah, yeah. How generous exactly is generous? Maybe you can reach him using a radio. He's certainly trying to find me. Do you really think that's a good idea? I mean, for a fiancé, he didn't really make much of an effort to protect you. Rufus, please. You're the only one I can trust. Yeah, that sounds about right. I really am the only one you can trust. The only one. And you already proved that you're of noble character. Mm-hmm. The burden of the hero. But let's get back to the expression generous. generous. Rufus, <laughs> please. All right, all right. Contact Cletus. I would be so very thankful. So very, very thankful. Well, oh, she's out again. I'm sorry. I don't know if I can do that. Can spam one tomo polo lollipop? Peekaboo. But. Bootam swadikosu loka shootapop. Oh, the <laughs> burden of the hero. Why do I always have to be so infinitely generous? Hey, I was like a new task. Contact Cletus. Save all that, on the point. Anyway, though, that's it for this episode. Yes. So, when we come back, we now have a new goal. Contact Cletus. But that's for next time, folks. So until then, until then, I'll see you all in the new year. See ya!